Hello, right now I'm showing you this application called Printopia for Mac. Uh, what this application allows you to do is print to a document, print to Dropbox, or print to just a standard printer. You, with the iPhone, the iPad, or iPod Touch running iOS 4.2. Now originally the technology used to do this was called AirPrint, and you still use the AirPrint technology to to, with Printopia, um, but with the with the original or first installment of iOS 4.2 that was released, print or the AirPrint technology, I guess you could call it, didn't work. Didn't you can't print to that many printers because it, it doesn't support it yet. You can only print to certain HP printers, and I think there's some other maybe there's like two other brands that it will print to, but most printers it will not print to. Even if you are running it on the Airport Express, which I've tried, it still doesn't recognize it. And so, after a minute of having this application installed, the, whatever printer is connected to your Mac, you will be able to see and print from your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch using the standard print, air print pop-up menus that you get in iOS 4.2 that you've probably seen. So there's a couple things you can do with this application other than just printing. You can also send to Dropbox or send to Mac. Okay, so now I'm going to be showing you how uh, this is the iPhone 4. How with the Printopia uh, application, what you can do is you can go into like your camera roll. And here is a picture of the D5000 camera that's being recorded with right now. And my Bauer lens. So we'll go, we'll press the little arrow down here, we'll hit print, then we'll select, it's already selected, but we'll select send to Mac, and we'll hit print. And now that picture that we just uh, hit send to Mac from the the print menu on my iPhone 4 is now on my Mac and it opened up in preview and this is the same photo uh, the same resolution and it only took probably three four seconds so that's one that's one thing you can do with this Printopia application is uh, file transferring like photos and um, so that's pretty cool. It's one useful thing. And there's many others. And printing a document is just as easy. So here's a document that I have that I opened up through mail. And right here, you click the little uh, window or uh, icon, I guess you could say, and you hit print. Brings you up to the same menu where you select what printer you want. And I still have it selected on Send to Mac. And now, we'll, actually, let's let's print this to the printer. So there's a printer that is connected to my Mac at the, uh, currently um, through USB, not wireless. And now we're going to hit print. We have one copy selected. And now we hear the printer going off. And so now that document that I was just on my phone is now in my hands on a hard copy. It only took a couple steps to get it printing and. Um, about three seconds for from the when I press the print button to the actual printing being initiated and now it's in my hands about 10 seconds later so it's a simple application uh, works great has many features you can do many things with it and just because we can we might as well test video out so let's record something real quick on my iPhone and we'll stop it there now let's go oh wait you can't print video so now you've seen the application and how you can use it what you can use it for and how simple it is to use you can usually go to printopia.com and download the application. You can download a free trial, which is a seven-day trial, or you can buy the application for ten dollars, which uh, ten dollars really isn't that much for what you get, you know. 
So it's real simple to set up. There's there's nothing you have to install on your iPhone. And there's no rebooting. There's no drivers need to be installed. Once you have it installed on your computer, it will just show up on your iPhone through the print menu using AirPrint. And you're good to go. So thank you for watching my video. Goodbye.